We have given you tours of specific manufacturers spaces here at the 2018 Cigar Retailers Convention, Las Vegas Convention Center in Las Vegas, Nevada. Now we're going to bring you in and do a quick walkthrough. There's about 300,000 square feet of meeting space and exhibit space. So we're in the next 10, 15 minutes, we're going to do a quick tour because it is not open to the public. So we give our fellow alphas and our lieutenants the opportunity to see for themselves what the Cigar Retailers Convention is all about and let you experience it through live video coverage. So we're going to do a quick walkthrough. Buckle your seatbelt. Here we go. First up, this is the General Cigar Booth. There's Ed McKenna, longtime friend brand manager for CAO. They've got the brand new CAO Nicaragua. Hey Ed, thanks for the box of cigars. I appreciate it. No, actually, I'm gonna take a couple of these. We'll smoke these later. Ed, tell me real quickly about these cigars. Yeah, this new CAO Nicaragua, uh, it's got a Hamastron wrapper and binder and three different uh, Nicaraguan tobaccos in the filler, Condega, Esteli, and Jalapa. Uh, so brand new for us, new addition to the world line for CAO. I feel badly for you. You're kind of lonely over here, so I, I had to come and visit you. We kicked Ricky out, so. Where is Rick Rodriguez? He's around. All right, we'll He's find him. Our good buddy, uh, Rico Suave, as we call him. Ed, I'll see you later. Right. This is the general cigar area, and you can see it is huge. And this year, what they've done is all their individual brands they've put in uh, along the walls, and it's almost like trick or treating. So the retailers can take a look from Punch, they've got Partagas Legend, Hoya by AJ Fernandez, La Gloria Cubana, there's Macanudo. There is the new Odyssey, Torano, Diesel Whiskey Row, and Cohiba. So this is the general cigar area. And again, a lot of action going on in here. And you can see it all. A lot of orders being written. But this is one of the big manufacturers' booths. So let's continue walking here. And the next up, we go from one large, and you can see down here there's other rows, there's some pipes, but we're going to take a walk here as we continue on. And you got to be fast, you got to be on your feet as we tour 300,000 square feet. We've got our great videographer, Fred, our audio technician. Mike, you guys ready? Up and down, yes, can you handle it? Okay, perfect. Here we go. We're going to Altatus, USA. And there's our good friend, Hank Bischoff, who we know from Boutique hey. Blends as we continue hey, around. Dave. Greetings. One of the great guys in the cigar business. Hey, Always a good friend. We do their officers club. He took yes, handle of a lot of stuff. So great. Yes, sir. And you can see a lot of new things coming from Asia. Real quickly, tell me the new releases. Ah, we got the Pudasepa, which is on the back wall over there. It's okay. an all Nicaraguan. Pudasepa translates into purebred. So it's all Nicaraguan. Wrapper, filler, binder, outstanding flavor. And we've got the core line over here. <clears throat> Fred, we'll turn back around here. You can see there's the core line. This is the core line we offer it in Maduro, in Connecticut, and in Habano, Dominican Habano. Uh, all 20 count boxes, regular shaped cigars. Down on the end, we have the Adrian Quattro. And we look, here's Tommy. Tommy Engel, by the way, Tommy is the uh, the rep for the Las Vegas and Cal what is it, Nevada, California? Las Vegas. Just Las Vegas? Las Vegas. That's your only gig? And Colorado. Vegas and Colorado. Yeah. This guy is getting paid too much and not working hard enough. Whoa. Okay? All he does is Rever go to the casinos. Reverse that. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> One of the great guys. I've known Tommy a long time. Long time. All right, so let's take a look over here and see what we've got. The Quattro. Yeah, we have the Quattro. We have the original F55 blend, which we've just renamed now the F55 original. Uh, the reason for that is because we've now released these other uh, wrappers. We have the uh, Adrian Quattro Nicaragua blend that's made for us uh, in collaboration with AJ Fernandez down in Nicaragua. We have the uh, Adrian Quattro Connecticut, has a beautiful uh, Ecuadorian shade wrap. And we have the uh, F55M for Maduro. Uh, it's got a delicious San Andres Maduro wrapper. Perfect. All box pressed, 20 count box. Love it. A lot of stuff from Aging Room. Altadas distributes it. Let's continue on Thank here. You. Hank, we'll see you later, my friend. All right, as we come around here, take a look. Here's the Altada sample wall right here. There's Joe. He's in charge of making sure the samples get uh, properly distributed and aren't pilfered. But you can see all their new blends, all the sample cigars right behind there in the sample wall. Let's take a look over here. As we come over, there's the new Ache Upman Connecticut Grupo de Maestros, one of their new cigars that you can see over here. Nice looking cigar. We're going to be sampling that. We're going to swing around. And there's Jill and Susan. They have not left their positions, just writing orders all day. Wave to the cameras, ladies. Beautiful. Don't work so hard. And then we're going to move over here. I want to find their new Nicaragua. Wait, they've got the new Nicaragua. I know it's around here. Where is it? Where, the back corner? 
No, where's there's a new Nicaragua? Is it the Romeo Nicaragua? Right over here. Where is it? Hold on. Come on here, everybody. We're going to take a look here. Well, there's the, uh, let's see, aging room. Here we go. Brand new Romeo y Julieta, 1875, Nicaragua. I smoked it today. Medium, medium full. Love the orange packaging, the orange band. Very, very nice. Elegant presentation. Made in Nicaragua. Beautiful cigar. That you'll see at retailers. Guarantee you're going to love that cigar. Let's continue on as we keep walking. Tony, how are you? All right, as we continue on here. Hey, Rob Norris, who's the president of Altadas USA. We just hey stopped guys. in the booth. We just saw the Romeo Nicaragua. Tell me about the cigar. You're making a big deal out of that. Yeah, yeah, we're having a big push uh, this year on Romeo and Juliet 1875 Nicaragua. Monte Cristo Nicaragua. So uh, please get involved. You got some samples. Have a well, I smoked earlier. Cigar. Nice medium, medium plus. Very balanced Definitely. cigar. Little, little very bit. enjoyable. We stopped by Aging Room. You've got the new H. Chapman Connecticut Grupo de Maestros. The new. Tell me about the Monte Cristo Artisan Series. Let's pop over here. And let's talk about this new line that you have. So these are new special limited editions. So we got the Grupo de Maestros uh, Batch 4. We got the Artisan Series 3. This is the last of the series of both of these. So we're going to put these to bed after this. So you need to get these, get them in the stores, and they'll be, uh, they'll be available in the, the next four weeks. And by the way, Enjoy Rob, uh, my condolences. Uh, Mick the Brit, I know you and Mick the Brit are wallowing in your Hello swallow. Mick. Hey, Mick. Hey, uh, exactly. England loses. I was looking forward to England kicking France's ass, and it's not going to happen. We're gutted. So we're all supporting Croatia tomorrow. So good luck. All right. We'll see okay. what happens. Thank Rob you. Norris, the president of Altadas, appreciate it. Thanks, Let's guys. continue yeah, on. Right. You can see we're at Gurkha earlier today. Things quieting down because the show's about to wrap up today. As we get towards the end of the day, let's continue on. And again, as you look around, you can see all the manufacturer's booths. Here's Syndicato. Look who's here. Gene Tipton, Jim Colucci, and Dan Genuine. Greetings, gentlemen. Oh, you good to see you. Filming this shit. We're good coming you, in. Buddy. Nice to see you, Dan. Looking good. The pride of Detroit. Not the as good as you, buddy. The Motor City. Never as good Gene, as you. you're on your what, 48th cigar of the day? Almost. Almost, 47. And Jim, uh, I know that for the Officers Club, we're doing Particulares, we're doing Sindicato Maduro, and the new Kubico, where is it? Right over here. Let's take a look at the new Kubico. And it's naked package. It's naked. It is uh, R-rated, I guess. Beautiful, square press cigar, tell me about this new stick. Well, this is a, a, a cigar that we've actually been selling, Dave, in the market since 2013. Really? Uh, yes. But, but you've redone it. You've rebranded it. No, no, no. We've been selling it only to uh, oh, small uh, number of people. It was a test market. Okay. And a, a small number of people. But now it's general distribution. It will be general distribution, and not until 2019, general. Till 2019. Yes. So our officers club member are going to be the first before the general distribution gets it this month. The July. general distribution is not getting till. 2019. Right, but our, our officers club members, guys are we're getting, getting it. it. Right, so this yeah. is a very special cigar. This is more a fuller flavored cigar, correct? This is about three quarters. Three quarters. Okay, and it's uh, got a uh, Ecuador Cubano wrapper, and it's got a Nicaraguan binder, and Nicaraguan and Dominican filler. Perfect. I'm going to take that, and I'm going to smoke that along the way. All Jim right. Colucci from Sindicato, I'll see you guys later. Thank you. Perfect. As we continue our tour on here, again, we've got My Father's Cigars here. Let's uh, move along here. We're going to walk through Ashton's booth. Ashton has a huge, huge booth, as you will see. And again, we're doing the quick nickel tour because this is a huge convention center. Closes in about three minutes, but we're going to continue moving along here. Here's the Ashton booth. And again, this gives you a really good idea of just the massive space that the cigar manufacturers have. I ran into Robbie Levin earlier. There he is. And uh, you can see all their products, all their cigars. And earlier today, the place was booming. Now things are quieting down as the show is about to close for the day. As we continue moving forward, let's see what else we have here. Again, massive amount. There's Casa Torrent, our good friends, the Torrent. Let me say hello to Alejandro Torrent. Alejandro, greetings. Hey. Greetings, greetings. We're doing our little hey, filming, thank giving you. the tour. How are you? Yeah, good to see you. Good. Thank you. So tell me, we got the three yeah. lines of Torrent now, correct? Yes, we got now the 1880, Casa Torrent 88. Is that the 1880? This is the one, yes. I just took one, so we're going to sample that tonight. I'll see you tomorrow. All right. All right, how's your dad? Good to see you. Very good, thank is you. Is he here? No. Not here? All right, well, we'll talk later. All right. Perfect. We're going to continue moving forward. Here is the Padron area. 
and I spoke with George Padron and Orlando Padron. This is the first year that Jose O. Padron, the founder of Padron Cigar in 1964, since he passed away, that they are doing the convention. And it's uh, kind of a somber time, and I know I've talked to George and to Orlando, but you can still, his memory still lingers on here, and I can still see him sitting at one of the tables holding court, but they're doing a great job. The family carrying on as we continue. Let's move along. And we're gonna go over to see my buddies over at Crown Heads. Kurt, how are you? Good greetings, greetings, greetings. All right, we're gonna go over to Crown Heads here. We're gonna see our good buddies, John Huber and Mike Condor. We featured some of their great cigars. They're La Carême, one of my favorites. They've got a brand new cigar that we are going to uh, talk about here. Let me see, I think it's over in the corner here. Here is John Huber, one of the co-proprietors of Crown Heads Cigars. John, my friend, exactly, good to the see general. you. So let's talk about the, the new Crown only. Heads. You've got a new it. Crown, by the way, La Carême, I love. You are being ambushed. ambushed. This is like 60 minutes. Is this live? It's live, baby. Oh my God. We're live. Okay. okay. All, All right, right, so let's go over. Tell me about the new Crown Heads. The new Crown Heads cigar is the Crown Heads Court Reserve 2018, made at Tabacalera La Alianza by Ernesto Perez Carrillo, three sizes, 5 and 5 H46, uh, 6 by 54 Sublima, and a Robusto. Why those three sizes? Because there are three of the original four kick sizes we started with, with Ernie in 2011, wrapper San Andreas Maduro. The binder is Ecuador, Nicaraguan fillers, price point $9.50 to $12.50, shipping in the fall, very excited about it, limited production, 150,000 cigars. What else can I tell you? You're going to ship that to that? me next week. All right, we're done. All right, That's John it. Huber from Crown Heads, by the way, La Carême, one Cheers. of my favorites. We yes. featured their cigars in the Officers Club, got great response, and maybe we'll do something, uh, a little surprise, maybe. Pink I'm ties coming. are my favorites too, by the way. Only Alphas can pull off a pink tie, maybe. You, only you. You got Absolutely. it. John All Huber, right. where's Condor, by the way, getting his massage at the Mandarin Oriental? Happy endings for Mike Condor. Here's the Rocky Patel booth. There's Cousin Nimish Desai. Here's Cousin Nimish. We're doing a quick you? tour. <laughs> oh, 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 hold on. Konnichiwa. <laughs> what, what, what the hell is this garb going on? Dude, this on what are you, a sushi Japanese, chef? No, my Japanese distributor gave me a, it's not a kimono. It's a sanumi. Sanumi. Yes. Beautiful. I'll Without tell you what. Pants. All you need is a little chef's hat, and you can be I'm rolling ready. nigiri and sushi over I'm at the. Uh, some hibachi style. Hibachi, yeah, exactly. The hat, and you can flip the uh, shrimp right in the top of the hat. <laughs> Beautiful. Stick to cigars, cousin Nimish. All right. All right. Gentlemen, as we continue on, they've got some new cigars over here. Their new ALR. They're age limited and rare. They've got a new um, Hamlet that's coming out. Their 25th year. They're bringing back. Uh, what did I see? They're bringing back one of these cigars. Not old world, maybe they are bringing back old world, but a lot of things going on over here at Rocky Patel. There's Nat Sherman, tobacconist to the world. As we continue on here, wait, I do want to go to Agio, and I know they're here somewhere. The question is, where are they? But we'll continue on, we'll find them. Not a problem. Perdomo cigars, every year, Nick Perdomo, who plays drums, on the uh, towards the end of the day, he does a little performance. So let's go into Perdomo Cigars and take a look. And again, you can see how massive these areas are. Perdomo Cigar, you can see how big it is. And we'll go over and watch Nick play the drums here. And we'll come right up close. President of Perdomo Cigars. We're live. Arthur, what are you showing right now? This is the Perdomo Habano Connecticut. Perdomo Habano Bourbon Barrel Aged. Beautiful. Thanks for the box, Arthur. Yeah, I'll see you luck. later. Tackle it, Nelson. Get it. Me. Arthur, right. we'll see you later. You can see a lot going on, a lot of action. 
And we'll continue on over here. There's Agio, just where I wanted to see. We'll go over this way. Actually, we'll sneak through this way. I see Jamie, their VP. There's. No, oh, come on in. Jono, come on in. Sneaky, we're live real quickly here. Jamie is the uh, Vice President of Sales and Marketing for Agio. Let's talk about your new stuff. By the way, I smoked the new Duetto last night. Phenomenal stick. You like it? I loved it, loved it. Tell me about this right. new cigar. All right, so this is a special collaboration between Boris Winterman, all right, and Ernesto Perez Carrillo. This is, a, this is all Nicaraguan with the exception of some exclusive stock cut. Uh, Mata Norte Tobaccos from Brazil, right, which is signature for the Balmoral line. This is under a completely new platform for Balmoral called Balmoral City Signaturas, which basically means Balmoral Signature Series. First in the line with Ernesto, we could be more excited about it. Great cigar, medium, medium full, a lot of flavor, very pleasant, suggested retail. Suggested retail, depending anywhere between 925 and 1250. When is it available to the public? Starting September. September, so it's about, uh, month and a half away. You got it. Fantastic. Right. All right, let's go over because you've got some new additions sure to the Balmoral Añejo XO line. You had the original uh, Añejo. That's right. So we got the original with the Brazilian Arapiraca wrapper. Very highly rated, beautiful medium bodied, very nice smooth finish. What we say about all the XOs, it's a perfect uh, balance of sophisticated complexity and smoothness. We have two new releases this year. You've got the Connecticut, which is a true Connecticut from Connecticut River Valley. It also has some Pennsylvania filler in there, as well as a stock cut Mata Norte to really smooth it out, but you get a good, sophisticated uh, uh, Connecticut wrap cigar. And we have a sun-grown Mexican San Andres wrapper in the Oscuro that, again, we think is extremely well-balanced. It's gonna, gonna excite consumers. I love the San Andreas Marone wrapper. A lot of flavor, a little bit of sweetness, some strength. So beautiful, and you can see some of the cigars here. Fred will let you get in. Beautiful looking sticks. And last year, the Añejo XO, which we featured in our Officers Club, through the roof. People love the cigar. And now you've really added to the portfolio. You've also got a value price line. Let's go we take do. a look at that real quickly as we continue our live tour at the Cigar Retailers Convention here in Vegas. Where is it? It's somewhere along here. Where it was over here. Wait, we're gonna find it. We're gonna find it. It was over here. It was, sorry guys, you just, you just, we just missed out. it? Yeah, okay, hold on. hold on. We're live, so you never know what's gonna happen as, as we continue on here. And you can see, you gotta lock everything up after hours or else it tends to disappear. But it's called their new San Pedro de Mar uh, Marcoras. Yep. They've got an Ecuadorian and a Brazilian. That's right, but let me give you a sense. Well, it's a four to six dollar, we're talking about a really elevated experience here in this four to six dollar price point. Nothing but a high grade wrappers, high grade binders, right? We've got two blends, as you mentioned. We've got a Brazil, which is really a Brazilian Arapiraca. Again, nice, robust, also sweet on the back end, still complex. And we have an Ecuadorian Connecticut wrapper uh, on the Ecuador as well. What's nice about these two cigars, it also features a true original Cuban seed, Piloto Ligero in the filler to help really accentuate the flavors while still getting the, uh, the, the the complexity and the sweetness that you'd expect from a cigar. Four so to six bucks, Four to six price. bucks, way more than you'd expect. Absolutely. In terms of flavor. And it's it's one of those cigars where the price doesn't match the quality because the quality is so good, it should be priced higher. It's gonna surprise the hell out of you. Can't wait. Well, we're gonna come see you down at Bradenton at corporate right. headquarters. We're gonna smoke a whole bunch of cigars. I'll see you tomorrow. Let's do it, thanks. All right, Jamie Brer from uh, Ag Royal Agio Cigars. Where's uh, Boris, is he around? Uh, no, he's not right now. He was here. He was here. The big boss was here. He'll he was here working. Again, All right, we'll see you later. Right. Thanks for the Thank quick you, tour. Let's continue on. And just to give you a sense of the scope and how massive, it goes all the way to the end of it. The, they take the entire northern end of the Las Vegas Convention Center. Just a massive amount of space. All cigars. The aroma of cigars is everywhere. It's very, very pleasant. Very nice. Let's continue on here. See, we were at Zycar earlier. Christoph Cigars. Let's go over to Casada. I'll see my good buddy Manuel Casada. We're gonna grab Manuel Casada. Let me interrupt. We're on live TV, Manuel. Come on, real quickly. Come on. I know he's up to his ass in alligators. Yes, we are. My good friend Manuel Casada. We go back a long time. All right, Manuel, 
Tell us about the new cigars real quickly that you have coming out. All right, the Fonseca Classic has been put in a new box, and because of the old... Uh, right, here it is over here. Come on over here. over here. I love the packaging, and you told me earlier that because the way the crops are growing, it's got a little bit more personality. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Fabulous. So the new Fonseca, well, it's a Fonseca Classic, just repackaged. Yes, exactly. And the crop's a little bit different flavor. There's another one you showed me that you've got, a brand new. Coming right here. Where do you see it? Where do you see this new cigar? And it is called the Vega Magna. You've heard of the Casa Magna? Now they've got the Vega Magna. Tell me about this, Manuel. Vega Magna is a Dominican filler and binder composition with an Ecuadorian Habano wrapper on it. Has a lot of oomph, not as in your face as Casa Magna, Colorado, right. but a lot of intensity and a lot of great flavors. And this is our new launching at the IPC. And I'll tell you what I like. If you look, this slides out, yeah. and that becomes an ashtray. And take a look at that. The artwork on that. I think that's you, Manuel. I, I see Good some alligators. Be. Could be. Manuel's favorite expression, I'm up to my ass in alligators. I think I see some somewhere lurking oh, in the yeah. distance here. Oh, yeah. You know they're there. Fantastic. Manuel, and I know you've got your girls that are here. Where are they? Wait a minute. Right they're, over there. They're getting ready to leave, but you're doing all the work. But we'll see them later. Right. Manuel Casada, longtime friend. Casada cigars, great stuff. Can't wait to smoke one of the new Vega Magnus tomorrow. Let's do that. We're coming. All right, let's General, continue on. You. Manuel, we'll thank see you. Guys. Let's go over here quickly. Ventura cigar over there. As we come over here, you can see we've got La Flor Dominicana. As we continue walking. And you can see people are wrapping up for the day. It started this morning at 9 o'clock. La Flor Dominicana. Hey, Greetings. Hey, Inez, here. how are you? Greetings. Tony, how are you? Where's Lito? I don't see Lito. Did he leave already? He's, he's rolling cigars. He's rolling cigars? Yes. That's on his virgin thighs? Yes. Beautiful. Excellent. So this is where it all happens for La Flor Dominicana. I'll see you all tomorrow. As we Thank come you. back, and let's go out this way real quick as we continue our tour. We've got all sorts of cigar manufacturers and accessory manufacturers all the way down. We'll take another swing. Let's see, I think we're gonna go this way. Let's go see Ernesto Perez Carrillo since I can see his booth right from here. Longtime friend, we feature their cigars in the Cigar Dave Officers Club. And just giving you the size, you can see how you can't do this in one day. That's why retailers come and spend three days here. And we're doing a quick perfunctory tour but they're writing orders, learning about the cigars, so it is an intensive three days. And as we take a look here, Ernesto, greetings, how are we doing? Wait, before we go, here's Ernesto Perez Carrillo. We're on live TV, Ernesto. Oh my greeting, God. Good, my good friend, long time friend. Ernesto, tell me what you have new this year. Well, we have the uh, Ringmaster, which comes in two sizes, a 64 by five and three eighths, and a 64 by six and a half. And it's a, uh, basically an all Nicaraguan puro. And that's big. It's big. Part of the inch series. Part of the inch series. Tell me what we have here. That's the uh, Capa de Sol. That we came out about two years ago. And that's one of our, you know, basically uh, newer uh, newer lines that uh, we've been uh, promoting the past two years. Well, you got a lot of action. I saw the booth today. You were busy writing orders. We were. It's a very good show. What was the name of the place you took me for lunch where we had that fried La fish? Camar Camaronera. La Camaronera. I always talk about that. When I come and see, I know you're going to be in Miami more. Yeah. I'm coming down. We're all going to lunch. Sounds good. All right. Ernesto Enjoy Perez Carrillo. Thank you, my good friend. Good to see you, my friend. We'll Thank see you. you later. Again, Ernesto, one of the masters in the world of cigars. Ernesto was the first manufacturer to come in with a super large ring gauges when he owned La Gloria Cubana and their Siri R line. Here's Tommy Bahama. They got some accessories and cutters and humidors. Drew Estate, where we ended up, or where we started earlier today. And so that gives you kind of a, just a huge perspective of what the Cigar Retailers Convention, the IPCPR Convention, is all about. There are, I think there's 300,000 square feet of meeting space. You can see a hub of activity, a lot of action still going on. The show officially closed 15 minutes ago, but people are still walking through and socializing and writing orders. So as we end our tour today, we hope you enjoyed our exclusive video coverage. And the reason that we present this is because consumers are not allowed on the show floor. 
we give you an in-depth look. We gave you a quick tour. We went earlier today, we started at Gurkha, we went to Davidoff, we went to Alec Bradley, we went to uh, Drew Estate, which we are ending up at. So you can see just the massive scope, tons of new cigars, and I can tell you, every cigar that I have sampled so far has been absolutely spectacular. So we hope you've enjoyed our exclusive day of video coverage from the 2018 International Premium Cigar and Pipe Retailers Convention, Las Vegas Convention Center, Las Vegas, Nevada. Cigar Day, the general saying, Mayor Humidor always be full. Mayor Cutter always be sharp. Mayor Ash be extra, extra long. A long ash snappy salute, remember, Semper Delictatio, always pleasure, long live the Alpha. We hope to, I hope you enjoyed our exclusive coverage. Go to CigarDave.com and our special IPCPR page where all of our video interviews will remain up until IPCPR 2019 next July. Hope you enjoyed our coverage. So long from the desert in Las Vegas, Las Vegas. viva Las Vegas.